Brew Pub Simulator. One of those fun demos that we uh, checked out a couple months ago. It's pretty fly. I dug it, and it's coming out in early access on July 21st. Link is in the description down below if you want to check it out yourself. We're going to hop on in. It's a new game. Oh my goodness. Three new games in a week. Oh. Yes, that's me. No, not the fruit of Einstein's loins. I'm the one in the back, the handsome one. My education ended faster than my family wished, but it still lasted too long for my taste. What I got out of college was mostly furniture for my cluttered apartment. Well, and acquaintances for life. I had already resigned myself to being back under my mother's wing when I received That's your a letter actual house, from California. Bro? That's your house, bro? It smelled bro? of hops and dirty rag and evoked it's, a vague memory of a lost alcoholic, tradition. Bro. The letter was written by my grandpa's lawyer. The old guy died alone, which is not surprising because his only love was brewing beer. He even claimed that our family came from a long line of master brewers from Europe, something like Assassin's Mead. So, uh, get this, my grandpa <laughs> left me in charge of his bar. Of course. Let me tell you, this could be my big break. I'll pay off my family and prove to them who deserves to be called the beer king of California. But I think I'll start by some hard cleaning and scraping the mold off the ceiling. Oh, jeez. They're calling me. What? If my watch is running well, you should have just arrived at our beautiful town. Gorgeous. Lucky for you, the brew pub is located across the street. Next to the bum? Without further ado, my name is Harvey. Hi, Harvey. I am your fa- Ah, uh, the glamorous life of a bartender. Picking up trash. At least I'm not picking up my ex's broken dreams. <laughs> Someone stabbed me. Can I toss this guy too? Looks like he's a roadie for Motley Crew. Take a walk on the wild outside. Uh. Oh, I guess I have to go in now. Ow. That intro was hilarious. Look in the trash. It's probably made by like sound. It sounds like it was made with some sort of like AI or something. Just like, hey man, I'm gonna prove to my grandpa who the real king of California is. It's like, okay, kid, good luck. There we go. We'll put that right there. Okay. I mean, did the guy just bounce out of here? Is this place haunted? To the back door. To the back door. Trash taken out. Time to start cleaning the dirt. Okay, bud. Pick up the mop. Check the exterior. Bump, bump, bump. What is that? Mop and the wiping cloth. By cloth. the lords of food poisoning and cat piss, I have the sweeping power. Uh, Some tells me it's gonna be a cringe fest. Let's go. Let's go. I'm down. I'm, I'm, I'm here for it. I'm 100% here for it. Hold on. Gotta clean it, clean it, wipe it. Twist it. Bop it. Gotta get a little squeeze, a little squeegee going on there. Gotta clean this riffraff out of here. Hey, go on now, scoot. Scoot. Edit brew pub. Oh, we can make our own logos and crap. Grandpa it up. always used to say that the bar is like a canvas, and I don't remember the rest, but maybe he meant painting the walls. God, this kid is so stupid. Oh my god, just so dumb. Skill acquired. Okay. Finally, a chance to express my artistic vision. Finally. Let's hope the customers appreciate the abstract look. They're not. Quick, let me hang some, like, these lights right here, can't do it. They, just, they have to be light bulbs. Those old-timey light bulbs. All right, press I for your inventory. Uh-huh, uh-huh, material changer to equip it. Material changer. Oh, look at you. Okay, control shows, oh, okay. So I have eight things to pick from at the moment. You know, we'll go with a brick wall here. Okay. Hear me out. Scream and shout, let it all out. Yes, yeah, I like it. What? 
I forgot to tell you, I received a package for you. There should be some useful things in there. Thanks cool. to our regional ninja Harvey. warriors, the package should already be with you. S these ninjas are so slick. I'm still decorating here, okay? Okay. We have an accent wall for all of our things. The wood gray. Okay. And there we go. I mean, we're already we're already set up. Hold on. You know what? Let's just match everything. There we go. Everything except for the accent wall over there. And then we'll have all sorts of crap thrown up on the walls. Kind of like a TGI Fridays or a shenanigans. <laughs> okay. Let's see what kind of packages we got going on here. Ninja box. What do we have here? Perfect. Exactly what I need right now. We have some tables and chairs. One table, four chairs. Okay. Okay. All right, bud. Excuse me there, bum. I'll tell you what, we'll put it right here, okay? And then we'll put an inventory, place the rest of the furniture. You got it, sir. We're clutch. We're in the clutch. A place for all you clowns to come and sit around. I do like the uh, grid. The grid snap's kind of cool. Naming a bar is like naming a child. You want it to be unique, memorable, and not end up in therapy. Go to the front of the bar, <laughs> front of the bar and open the, the brew pub. Okay. What should we call you? Oh. Mm, we've got a lot of different logos in here. Really? The Jackie Chan meme? Really? You know what? We got America. We got a Statue of Liberty right here in red. Hmm. I likes it. Now, as far as the ribbon goes, on the other hand. Uh, we'll do it blue. There we go. Yes. What about this one? Ah, see, this would be cool if that went over top of the logo. I don't know which one I like. Ah, we'll take that one. Ah, we'll take that one. You know what? I like that one. We'll keep the black background, the text. Anything fancy? You know what? We're going to go with that. Now, let's see. Libertad. <laughs> uh, let's see here. You know what? We'll call it Liberties. Why not? Let it rain free. Oh, it's beautiful. It's so freaking beautiful, man. Oh, it's so beautiful. I just remembered something. Recently, an old friend of your grandpa's brought some beer to the brewery for him to try. Okay. Prove your worth as a brewer by selling this beer down to the very last drop. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna make it. I'm gonna make Free him guzzle it up. Ready to serve? How suspiciously convenient. All right, looks like it's four. It's on fire. American Pale Ale. Okay, I have the beer. Now I just need to hook it up to the tap. Okay. So pick up the connection tube, picked it up, look at the beer keg, I'm doing it, I'm connecting it, now look at the shank, you mean the, the pipe? Done. Now something tells me that I should add the beer to the menu, otherwise well. customers won't know what's on offer. Oh no. Let's go to the menu, American Pale Ale, we must select it. Great, now you can close the window, I'm doing that. That should do it. Yeah. Okay, I have the beer, but I still need something to serve it in broken pouring beer directly into mouths is not an option at least not until spring break <laughs> <laughs> guys a creep all right tablet we need some beer pint glasses how much money do we have twelve dollars okay so that will get me add any box with glasses all right add to cart and that gives me how many six okay okay Add any boxes of glasses to the cart. Press order to purchase it. You got it. Beautiful. Oh. All right. Let's get some glasses here. Get Aha. Ready, folks. That was the nice. Party's about to start. Or Is to it be now? Specific, a seven hour shift. I do like okay. how all the logos here are also on top. So everyone can see. Everyone can see what they're about to order. 
Look at the open sign and press L and B to open the bar. Oh. I thought, <laughs> I thought we were I open the whole the time. I smell of beer in the morning. All right, so it looks like okay. we got seven Take minute shifts. Pour the beer and serve it to the customer. Don't okay, I'm doing it. Nice. We're doing it. We are a bartenders. Just give me a beer. Just give me a beer. I demand it. There you go. Nice. Give me that tip, bro. Give me that tip. I'll give you the tip. Just a tip. Just see how it feels. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Here I am just cleaning glasses and staring at them because there's no TVs or anything of that nature inside of here. It's pretty lackluster when it comes to the inventory. What's up, homie? I definitely need to clean this glass. A dirty glass in a pub is like a fly in the soup in a restaurant. Oh, okay. We got skills. Number one, please. What is this, McDonald's? All right, we got $26. Now we've cleaned the glass cleaner. So now we're not slobs. <laughs> okay, what's up, sir? Fresh, clean glass. It's gross. It's actually, really, really, really gross. Ah, oh, so you hit control and then that dumps it out. That's stupid. It's a dumb way to. That's a dumb way to clean the glass. You want a beer? Yeah, you do. You lush. You friggin' lush over here. Oh, yeah. You're dirty. All of you are dirty. Want a beer? American Pale Ale? Like, you have a choice. Of course. Nice. So now it's nice, a nice little shade. <laughs> We're gonna put that there. Let me just clean this up for you there, sir. Ma'am. Sir, ma'am, sir. You filthy beggars. Like, they don't even give me a chance to actually clean clean up the stuff. It just tells me like, hey, you got you got filthy filthy dirty customers. Well, I guess cleaning in a bar is part of the profession. Is it? People can't clean up after themselves. Scummy, scummy, awful human beings. Gross, trash. That's what I thought. Trash. Hey, you come here. Excuse me. Hey, you, come here. I don't answer to hey, you. Is that the bum? The bum is asking me for a favor? Of course he is. I expect nothing less. Oh, we got customers. Don't mind me, I'm just uh, cleaning up everything over here. Just trying to make some chatter in this crazy, wacky day world, sir. You have a fantastic day. Evening. Hope you get that girl, you know what I'm saying? Get that lady you was talking about. Well, what's up with the disguise, sir? S sir? What do you want? I have a lot of things to do, so I have a quick tip for you. Okay, albatross? Albatross! Did you know that when picking up a glass, you can also place it on a tray? Yes. Thanks to that, you don't have to carry each glass individually. Thank you. Just right-click on the glass. You should oh, figure okay. out the rest. That's all I've got for you for now. Now go away and make people happy. You know, for a bum, he sure does have a lot of confidence and a lot of appreciation for our craft. I almost feel bad for calling him a bum. Hold on. No, I don't. I got a lot of things to do today. It doesn't look like you're doing anything, bud. Looks like, uh, looks like you're lying to me. You know what I'm saying? So hold on. If I right click this. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's nifty. Can I put this down, though? Okay. How are you today, everybody? Just keeping those beers... Keeping those beers pouring, you know what I'm saying? We're just selling the remaining brew. Whoa, 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 whoa. Brings me back to the good old days when I used to be a bartender. 
when I used to bartend in a resort town. Very busy, very busy. I was a very busy bartender. Very busy. What? No. So far we're clearing some pretty good cheddar over here. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Sometimes this glass gets a little wonky. Now there will be a day one patch, just to give everyone a heads it's up. Empty. Oh no. I think the customers will understand if I close the place a little earlier. Yeah, yeah, they'll understand. Do they have a choice? All right, reputation plus 195 out of 200. Prestige 4.8 out of 5, <laughs> you know. We're almost perfect, almost. Practically perfect in every way. Orders 14, finished orders 13. That's because the lady was in line and I didn't have any more beer left. Total expense is $26 to fix the sink. Employee cost zero because I pay myself $43. I have to be careful and watch over the beer fountain. I don't want the customers to burn me at the stake. What is he talking about? What are you talking about? They call me. This is Harvey. I saw the recent reviews of your brew pub. And? If the average rating of your establishment drops, fewer customers will visit your pub. Don't worry, they'll they'll love this place. I'll make it the best dive bar they've ever been to. The best. Don't worry, you can easily improve your average rating. In the tablet, you have a reviews tab where you can check what customers are concerned about. Okay. Oh, I was gonna say, I th did a customer steal a glass? Aha. Uh -huh. Recent. Being thirsty, I got a beer. What more could you want? Five stars. <laughs> that's, that's right. Not an alien. Totally not an alien. Who was the person that had a problem? Here, Charles. Got the exact beer I wanted. I had a great opportunity to practice my patience waiting in line for a beer. Oh, stop. Stop. Such a silly goose. So silly. I need to keep an eye on the reviews of my brew pub. Do I, though? They call me again. I'm waiting for a phone call, baby. What is that? I heard that the bar is inviting customers again for a good old pint. That means you completed the first challenge from the old man. Cool. You've proven that you have a good head on your shoulders. We can move on to the next challenge on the list. Okay. All right, so what's next? Hey, you, come here. Hey, you, come here. Uh, okay. So, also, this is the story mode. Just want to give everyone a heads up that uh, you go through the entire story of the bar opening, and then after that, it leads you to your own demise. There's also a sandbox mode, so don't be afraid if you uh, don't care for the <laughs> tutorial. Like, once you get to the tutorial, you can make your own bar. I've been watching you since you arrived. I, yeah, because you've been here the entire time. I see potential in you. Do you? I left something for you in the parcel locker. You'll figure out the rest on your own. Is That's it heroin? That's all I've got for you for now. now. Okay, that was... something. Like, why can't you just- why couldn't you just walk in and just hand me a box? Jerk. Got a new recipe unlocked. Alright, what do we got here? What do we got here? In the recipe. It's easy, I say. Nice. Exciting for days. Cool down days. What? Wow. Okay. So I guess we're brewing. Take the pot from your inventory. I have, I have a pot. When did I get this pot? We're brewing beer. Alright, 5.3. It's close enough. I'll take it. Place the pot and put it on the stove. Uh-huh. Take the malt extract from your inventory. Let's do it. Light malt extract. We're gonna pour it in the pot. How many? We got 10 milliliters. We got light malt extract of 1.3. All right, 1.3. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna I'm assuming that two of these is gonna equal one liter. And then we'll do the 10. One, two, three, four, five. I'll tell you what, we'll go up. Smidge. There we go. Perfect. Crushing it. Alright, walk to the pot, look at it, and press L and B to start adding hops. Okay. Cascade the hops. Yes, yes, it's quite good. Quite good indeed. Alright, cascade hops, 10 grams. A lot. There we go. Smooge. Did it. Regards. 
pop that there. And then we go into our inventory, get that yeast. Oh wait, hold on. Put that there. We'll turn on the stove. Wait until the water boils 100 degrees Celsius. How can we tell? Boil for 60 minutes. You can check the boiling time by cooking or looking at the pot. Aha, gotcha. All right, so we wait for 60 minutes and it looks like we turn off the stove and wait until the mixture cools down to room temperature 21 degrees Celsius and then we add the yeast. And then we gotta transfer to a fermenting bucket. All right, here we go. We got 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60 minutes. Turn off, turn off the stove and wait for the mixture to cool down to 21 degrees Celsius, which is like 5,000 degrees hot. I'm guessing. Cool it down. Cool it down. It's going, it's going fast. Will it stop at 21 degrees? It does. Perfectly. Of course it does. We got five grams of yeast. Yeast, five milliliters. Gotcha. That's all we wanted. That's all we needed. That's all we needed to have. There's five grams over here. It says five milliliters on the <laughs> on the right hand side, and then you scroll down, and then it says five grams. Which is it? Which is it? Which is it? All right. So pick up the pot. Out. It's hot. Hot. Ah. Ah. Uh. Ad to tilt. Oh. All right. Pop that down right there. Look at the fermenting bucket and press E to put the lid on. Got the lid on. Congratulations. Now have to wait uh, for the beer to ferment. And we're and we're going to sleep, apparently. All right. So we got three. Enter. To edit the beer. American Pale Ale. Right. So let's edit this beer. Oh, that's right. We have to do all kinds of cool stuff. Name your beer. Freedom Ring. Freedom's Ring. Yeah, I like it. Edit. Edit. Yeah, that'll work. Confirm. Price five eighty nine. Listen, let's make it five fifty. We only deal with quarters, all right? As a bartender, nothing's worse than getting pennies and nickels thrown at you because your beers are a dollar sixty or two dollars sixty cents or four dollars and eighty three cents. It's five fifty. I'm not messing around with anything anything less than a quarter, all right? And that's the long and short of it. All right, unpin the recipe. Hey, you, come here. Ah, uh, how about please, clown? What? You know, I'm something of a brewer myself. No, you're not. You're a bum. I can assess the potential of beer and the brewer just by smelling. Gross. I think you can even make some money from this beer. This guy looks like he teaches yoga. That's all I've got for you for now. Now go away and make people happy. I believe this guy has some backstory. Anyway, the beer is ready. I need to transfer it to the keg, connect it, add it to the menu, and people will be able to taste the fruits of my labor. Ew. I want to just taste my fruit. How about that? All right, so we got to pick this bad boy up, put it down. Okay? Then we pick up the fermenting bucket, and we drop it near the beer keg. We'll pop it right there. Then we take... Yeah, disconnect the cube, disconnect all tubes. We take the connection tube. Fermentation bucket down to here. All right, wait for the transfer. It's been done. We disconnect this. Amazing. Pick up the connection tube. The beer to the shank. And now we have our first brew. Freedom's Ring. Amazing. I want to check it out. The logo's on there. That's pretty dope. I dig it. An email. The email. What? What? The email. Mayor Maya. Maya. Hi, kiddo. First off, that's not how you... S <laughs> Is this... Do, do you know me? Not long ago, I used to collaborate with your grandfather. Okay. When, when you say collaborate with my grandfather, do you mean that you were banging him? Collab collaborate? I'm using air quotes. Not long ago. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here's the situation. A small charity gathering is coming up soon. There will be catering. But unfortunately, the champagne has gone missing under suspicious circumstances. Can you arrange five liters of lemon-flavored beer to accompany the food? Can I? The beer must have citrus flavor. Minimum quality. 
Open the tablet, navigate to the emails and app and accept the quest. Okay, so we have no choice. Sure. Minimum quality three. Minimum volume five liters. Time limit ten days. Beer must have a citrus flavor. Right. Hey, you come here. Ah, man. What, dude? It's time for the next stage of your training. Freestyle. You only live once, so why not try adding some flavor to the beer? YOLO. I left something for you in the parcel locker. Add this ingredient right after the beer has cooled down. The outcome may surprise you. That's all I've got for you for now. Now go away and make people happy. First off, man, where are you getting all this cardboard at? Where are you getting, like, the delivery? Like, you, you just holding that? Holding that in your, in your pants? Lemon dried. Okay. Got ourselves some lemons now. Alright, let's go ahead and pick up the pot. Alright, place the pot on the stove. Malt extract. Okay. 13 milliliters. 1300 milliliters. Not enough ingredients. What do you mean? Now I gotta get that? Okay, so it doesn't let me get the new trash. Fine. Oh, it just told me I have an additional one in my inventory. Ah, oh, you cheeky buggers, you. See, that's what happens when you don't read, chat. That's what happens when you don't read. Read? I was born to lead, not to read. Okay. There we go. Now, exit. Yeah, 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 yeah. And we got you. Now, what do you need? All right, it's 10 grams. Add hops. Been added. There we go. Pop you. And we crank it up, baby. Crank it up. So there definitely have been some improvements since the uh, prologue or the demo in which we played. This was more of a convoluted process before. Now they kind of have it a little streamlined here a little bit. Still a couple wonky things, but all in all, everything's all right. We just toss this, throw out. Throw out. You know what? I'm just gonna leave it right there because you're trash. But this is definitely one of those cool places, cool kind of games where you can really be, uh, you know, silly and creative. Have your bar, call us up and dumb, yell at the customers. You know, fun stuff. The only reason to have a bar in the, in the first place. Okay. Now we gotta cool that bad boy down. Cool down the. Okay, we got some yeast. Put that in there. There we go. It says five grams, not five milliliters. Open the lid in the fermentation bucket. Uh huh. Okay. Pick up the pot. And now we pull in. go. We're excelente. And then we have to go into our inventory again. We get that lemon. And then we have to put in 10 grams of this. We're amazing. Bucket. They call on me. What? I see you're getting into the swing of things. Okay. One of the local breweries has agreed to brew beer for you. Oh, good. Since they don't have good recipes themselves, they will base their brewing on the beer you have already made. So they're not really... Beers will be available beer for purchase from beer the makers? store on the tablet. Then? Ninja couriers should deliver the beer within moments. I hope this will help you whenever you don't have time to prepare beer by yourself. Well, I mean, that is kind of nice. That way we don't have to constantly create new Ready batches. It may be... All right. Sorry, I cut him off. So now the open open the bar and serve your customers as usual. The fermentation will end the next morning. Okay, so we just well we got another day, but that is kind of nice. It's nice that you don't have to worry about doing the uh, all of the heavy lifting all the time. And this is bugged out because it's constantly uh, highlighted. There we go. Liberty, freedom. All right. Now let's open the bar. Let's make some chatter. What's up there, short round? You good? Number one, please? The freedom ring, ma'am. Give yourself a wonderful evening. 
You know, I should really put all of this closer. There we go. Oh, that was hilarious. That was hilarious, Linda. Hey, APA, please. Sometimes the, uh, the, the computer glass gets a little caught up. So you get that, you get to make sure you just take your time. A lot of short people here today. Excuse me, is there a little person convention around here? No, you jerk. Okay. No, don't throw this. <laughs> For some reason, it was not, it was bugging, bro. Well, we broke a glass. Crap happens. Have to order some more. Busy night. Busy evening. Busy evening, ma'am. Busy evening. Ma'am, you have a fantastic evening. Get home safe now. A lot of creeps out there. Oh, she's going to the bathroom. Ah, technically, I'm the creep. That's me that I was talking about. See, and we can line them up in the back. All right, so we can see how many we got. Look the trash. Wipe down the tables like a good boy, like a good bartender does. Good barkeep kicks it. Filthy. I can't go in the bathroom, huh? Well, that's probably a good thing. <sighs> I can see customers coming in. We got two minutes and fifty seconds until the bar is closed. Some of these, some of these glasses, man. Okay. Sometimes it just doesn't want to, just doesn't want to work the way you want to work it. How do you do, ma'am? See, like if it goes into a weird box, then it comes back out. You gotta like go in and then out. Your pull game has to be strong. Oh no! We're all- we all out? Oh god. I almost- I almost just chucked that at her. You know what, we're gonna close the, uh, close up shop. Sorry, we are closed. I'm all out of beer. You done drank me- you drank me dry. Bar stool, nice. We're unlocking stuff, level 2. Prestige, Prestige, 4.9, 5.0. Today's review amount for rating 50% rep reputation, 5 out of 5. Nice. Total expense is $10. Yeah, because I broke a glass. Sorry, buddy. Uh, he was coming in here. He's going to get some action. He's like, yo, all the ladies is in there. You know what I'm saying? I need to get in there. Let me in. Look at that. Exciting for days. Exciting for days. First off, this is a cheap IPA. Can I just type in here? I can't. So I have to screw with this. Four ninety nine? Absolutely not. That's so un American. Four ninety nine for a beer. Just give me five dollars. Five oh one. Nope, can't do it. Four ninety nine or five oh one. Can't type it in. Can't do it. I swear to Christ. You know what? I'll tell you what, since so we got we got the, the the bear here, let's call it something different here. Um Cali Ale. Because, because, no one then. That's because you got yourself a bear on there. It's beautiful. It's gorgeous. Majestic, even. The ribbon, we'll put that one as red. Text, white. And the background. Yeah. Let's do a little, uh, that's too much. We need something darker. No. Yeah, that'll work. 475. Sensational. Where did all this dirt pop on up? Huh? Huh. I hear something weird. For some reason, I gotta go looking for some of these glasses when I close up shop. Excellent. Yeah, so when it comes to these glasses, how I had them lined up there for a second, it seems like a good idea. But maybe on day one patch, it'll probably fix a couple things here that were not working out. <sighs> Let's put that there. Open the inventory, equip a beer keg, and place it near the shank. Oh, okay. All right. Beer keg. Oh, whoops. Open the inventory and equip the connection tube. Hold on. Got our lemon brew over here. Pour it all in there, and then we... Disconnect all the lines. I'll take this. Hide an inventory. Amazing. 
Take this over here. Pop this here. Put the keg... Put the keg in the left door of delivery locker to send it. Oh. Oh, this is a lemon ale. Oh. Well, we'll have to edit that. Hope my craft beer creation will be enough. Collaborating with the mayor could be an opportunity for the development of my business. We gotta re-edit, we gotta edit that name for sure. For sure. Now wait until the next morning to receive a, p a positive response from the mayor. If you fail, don't worry. You can try again via the email. So emails. Okay, so I may be in a bit of a predicament. So we sent that keg out, and then it tells us, now wait until next morning to receive a positive response from the mayor. If you fail, don't worry. You can try again via the emails. I even made another bit of freedom ring. But, like, I don't know how to speed up time. Like, call a day. Tablet. Containers, decorations, furniture, minigames, supplies, tools, beers. This is the Cali L that we made and sent it all on over to her. I'm looking in here. I have no idea what I'm looking at. Checking reviews. The recipes. It's cool. And then this. Which is the shop. I ordered more glasses. I got a beer sign. Got all the football stuff. Oh, oh, so this is where you go to get all the different decorations. Oh. There we go. You can decorate. Look at all the different options that you have available. You can really make your bar yours. Now the problem is, is that I can't, <laughs> I can't, I can't seem to, can't seem to go anywhere. Oh, we got a World Heavyweight Championship belt for thirty dollars. It's so enticing, but we'll hold off on it. Oh my God, it's amazing. I'm really looking forward to this game, man. It's just something's going on right now where I, I I'm not sure how to speed up time. Hope my craft beer creation will be there. Enough. We go. Collaborating with the mayor could be an opportunity for the mayor. development of my business. Okay, send the keg using the delivery locker. I did. All right, so it's in there. Send the keg using delivery locker. I did. It's in there. It's in there like swimwear. But now what? We are not open. No. To infinity and beyond. No, I don't have any beer. Close this, John. Grow big. Okay, so we have to... Okay, alright. $50 reward. Cool. Charity event was a success thanks to your beer. Thank you for your assistance. I will contact you soon regarding the construction team that could help expand your establishment. Expand my establishment. Grow big. I'm a grower, not a shower. Help me help you grow big. All right, I found a renovation team that could take care of expanding your space. The problem is that the team won't lift a finger until they receive nine liters of beer. Well, those filters, which will prove that they have a reason to abandon their current job. During the renovation of the city hall, they ate all of our donuts. No, not all the donuts. They must have a sweet tooth. And they're luscious. Perhaps that's a clue on how the hidden taste buds. Okay, so requirements, additions, minimum quality. Yeah, I'll accept. I suppose. Place a keg of beer inside the delivery locker near the bar's entrance. Okay. Always something messy. Always something messy. Always something filthy. Okay. So create a keg of beer matching the requirement and send it via the delivery locker. No. No, I think I'm good. I think I'm alright. <laughs> we got some garbage beer up there. American Pale Ale. Ugh. I think I've I done good. We gotta correct ourselves. We gotta figure it out. But folks! That is going to be our video for today. It's a, it's an interesting game, for sure. The, the day one patch, probably going to pick this back up when it comes out on the 21st. Link is in the description down below. I just want to see what updates we might have to just start again. We'll do this on a live stream or, for, you know, more videos for sure. But this, it does have a lot of wonkiness to it still. It sure does. It sure does. Oh, yeah, it does it. You got to give me something to, to speed up time. Leave a comment in the comment section down below if you have any hints, tips, or tricks, and I would love to hear it. But folks, if you enjoyed this video by all means, hit that like button, help us out my channel ever so much more you know, and if you like it a whole lot, go ahead, hit it, hit subscribe. New videos come out every single day, live streams every week. Man, that logo is ugly. Make sure you hit the bell notification be aware of all the new content. Everyone, peace out, like, shout y'all, and I will check you out right here again in Brew Pub Simulator.
next time.